Hello boys and girls, my name is Kim Middleton. Some of you may recognize me as I'm your school nurse at Monticello Brown Summit. I also have a son who attends Monticello Brown Summit, Colton Middleton. Uh, I'm going to talk to you today a little bit about my job as a school nurse. I am a registered nurse with the Guilford County Public Health Department and we are contracted with Guilford County School System to be school nurses for Guilford County Schools. To be a school nurse, you have to graduate high school and go to college for about four years to obtain your bachelor's of science degree in nursing. To be a school nurse, you have to like working with the public and you have to like working with kids. Um, you also have to be um, creative and innovative and be able to think on the spot. Um, and we learn a lot of medical terminology and a lot about the, the human body. Um, school nurses use a lot of math because um, we calculate medication dosages, we convert measurements, um, we use technology because a lot of our stuff is done on the computer or done with machines um, like taking um, a pulse ox, um, sometimes blood pressures, temperatures, you know those things are digital. Um, we also learn a lot of science and about the human body um, because we have to know what's normal with the body and what's not and um, you know like if you're sick or something's wrong with your body. Um, we use a lot of writing because we have to document everything we do and when we see a student we document what we've done um, and we use um, community uh, critical thinking skills because um, we work independently and we have to think on the spot and be quick about what we're doing. Um, as far as my job description, I am in the school to keep you healthy and safe while you're at school. And um, like if you're sick or if you're hurt or, or have a chronic condi um, medical condition that needs to be maintained while you're at school, I assist with that. And when I'm not at the school, I train the staff, the teachers and the um, front office staff and all to um, take care of those things when I'm not in the school. I have three different schools. I have three schools, um, so I have Simpkins Elementary, I have Faust Elementary, and then I have your school, Monticello Brown Summit Elementary. Um, so I am only at each school about a day and a half a week, um, so um, I'm not there all the time. So I have a mobile office is what we call it, where I travel from place to place. So I don't work in one spot, so my stuff goes wherever I go. Um, so some of the tools that we use in my job are we use blood pressure cuffs to take blood pressures. We use stethoscopes. This is to listen to like hearts and lungs. Um, we use oh, this is called a pulse ox to see how much oxygen level is in your blood. Um, we use pen lights to look in um, like pupils and eyes and ears and all. Of course, thermometers. This is a temporal one that takes the measurement of your temporal artery. Um, this is called an otoscope where we can look in your ears to see if there's fluid or redness or anything in your ear. Uh, we use tweezers, like if there's something in your skin, we can use these to get them out. We also use things like band-aids and gauze if you get hurt or scrape a knee or something like that. We use ice packs if you're hurt. So we use a lot of different things um, in our jobs. The challenging thing about my job is that I have three schools. So I can't be at one place or one school all the time, so I have to um, travel from school to school. So that's, that's challenging because I can't be in, uh, be in one place all the time to um, help you guys. Um, my favorite thing about my um, job is that I get to um, know you guys really well and then I get to watch you learn and grow as you go through, you know, from grade to grade as you get older. Um, and I also really like that I'm at my, um, the same school as my son. So it's nice also being at the same school with him. That's a perk. Um, stay healthy and safe, and I can't wait to see you guys back at school. Bye!